Hello and welcome to this exciting tutorial. In this one, we'll be taking a look at how we can do screen sharing using JavaScript. So here on my screen, you can see that we are sharing a website right now. So this has been opened in a different tab and I'm sharing it over here. I can go ahead and make some changes over here and the same will be reflected. For example, if I go and say W3 schools, you'll notice the same over here coming up and there you go. So the moment you change something, it is reflecting over here. You are basically sharing your screen and all this has been done using just JavaScript and a bit of HTML. So let's go ahead and see how we have done this. So I'll click on stop sharing over here and I'll take you directly to the code. And the code, as you can see, we have a video container over here and a video class defined. This is for this section over here that we have covered in the div. And we have this button which says the start. So the moment you click on that start button, whatever screen that you want to share will appear over here inside this div and within this video. So the streaming aspect that is there is being taken care of over here. We are making use of the video tag to display whatever content is being streamed. And the code for that is over here in app.js file. You see just 20 lines of code and we are done with screen sharing. So primarily what we are doing is we are getting these like start button and then this screen sharing ID. So we have a start button and a screen sharing video. And then we are checking whether the browser supports screen sharing or not. And that is done by checking for media devices from the navigator namespace. So we are saying navigator.media devices or navigator.media devices dot get display media. If it's not true in that case, it is going to say that screen sharing is not supported. Otherwise, we have a click listener over here and that click listener is being assigned to the start button. So the moment you click on the start button, this is going to call this start screen sharing. And here the start screen sharing will then stream the content. And where exactly it is going? If you see this line, line 14 over here, screen sharing video dot SRC object is equal to stream. So the stream that we are capturing is then redirected to the video tag that we have. And the start button is disabled so that no one's click on that button again. And that's pretty much it that we are doing and we are able to successfully share our screen. Let's take a look at it one more time. So here I'll be running it. And this is our screen share application. We click on start screen sharing. And here we get the tab window or entire screen. Let's go with the tab first. So here I've opened up W3 schools. And if I click on share, it will start showing that screen. And if I change this again to my website and share it, there we go. We have the output coming up over here. So this is being shared right now. And if you want to see it, let me put this screen over here as well. So this is what we are sharing right now. I hope you like this one. Stay tuned for more such videos. Thank you.